World War 3 Team Yankee is a fun and balanced game by Battlefront miniatures depicting the fictional Soviet invasion of Europe in the 1980s. Team Yankee is based on the book of the same name by Harold Coyle, in which a unit of the US Army named Team Yankee struggle to hold off those damn commas with freedom and EU rounds. Built on Battlefront miniatures legendary Flames of War rule set, enjoy fast-paced and engaging Napoleonic game players platoons of closely packed infantry and tanks simulate parades and car parks on the modern battlefield. Will NATO and their millions prevail, or will the Soviets rush be and squat in Paris? Build and command your forces in 15mm glory and wage war in tiny tanks. Are you sure about that? Maybe you're here for the cool tanks. Maybe you're here to fight to spread your preferred form of economic oppression. Or maybe you're here to titillate your acronym fetish. To play Team Yankee, you will need a 6x4 foot table, a tape measure, a whole bunch of D6 dice, an army of painstakingly assembled and painted models, and some friends to play with. That one will probably be the toughest, to be honest. What follows is a basic layout of a standard turn. 1. Starting step. This is where most of the administrative stuff happens. Check the morale of your formations and units. Roll for reserves. Rally pinned units. Free bog down tanks. Remount bailed out tanks. Remove smoke from the previous turn. Etc. 2. Movement step. Move your units and rush B. The amount a unit can move is dictated by the terrain they have to deal with. The majority of orders are given in this phase as well. 3. Shooting step. Peace through superior firepower. Target enemy units and shoot to thrill. All shooting and artillery occurs in this phase, with smoke being fired before any other shooting. Roll some dice, and send sons back to their mothers in body bags. I hope you like rolling those sixes, you're gonna need it. 4. Assault step. Blood for the blood god. Units charge into close quarters, to beat the enemy to death with their rifle butts or crush them underneath their treads. Infantry teams don't get saves in close combat so be wary. Keep in mind that you will be fighting over objectives instead of just killing each other, although that is a healthy approach to winning, and plan your strategy like a true armchair general. This series of videos will delve into list building and specific strategies for your favorite tanks, aircraft, and infantry. Join us on this journey as Yankee Team reviews new releases and units of note as well as alternate armies not featured in the game. If you have any suggestions on formations or units to cover, let us know, and we will ruin your day for you. This is Yankee Team, signing off.